Hello everyone, and welcome to Max Carl. Hit the subscribe button, hit the like, stay cool. Six superstars who want to return to WWE and their rumored opponent. A WWE Hall of Famer who last wrestled in 2006 wants a match with Vince McMahon. Another wants to face The Undertaker. These superstars want to return to WWE and have a few dream matches. So with all that being said guys, let's get into the list. So at number one we have the immortal one Hulk Hogan. A few years back Hulk Hogan was not in the good books of WWE as he had removed due to racist comments that he made. But the legend made a return to WWE in 2018 and was reinstated back into the WWE Hall of Fame. Hogan was, hasn't wrestled in the WWE and thought until his last match in 2012, but his last match in WWE came back in 2006. The Hall of Famer revealed last year that he wants to have one more last match WWE and reveal a surprising opponent that he would like to face, that is who Hulk Hogan would like to face. This is what he said, yeah I've been talking to Vince McMahon, history is very important to me, I've had a long career. And part of that career was very small company and very gracious lady named Dixie Carsoner at TNA. I had actually had my last match at TNA. That's hard for me to live with. I want my last match to be with the WWE. I'm going to have one tiny surgery on my back. It'll take me a couple of months to recover, but I've got my eyes focused on WrestleMania. The one man I would like to get in the ring with. If I had only one person, it would be Vince McMahon, Hulk Hogan said. Now, would you all like to see Hulk Hogan, the immortal one, taking on Vince McMahon? I personally would like to see Hulk Hogan in his last match face this man here. As you can see, John Cena. This was what I was wanting to see at this year's WrestleMania, but unfortunately, as you all know, with the current situation, it did not happen. But hopefully, it will happen sooner rather than later but anyway guys at number two we have one of the greatest of all time considered by many he is known as a people's champ he is known as the rock ever since leaving to the WWE to become a hollywood actor the rock has become one of the biggest stars in the world but his career has come to a standstill with his last match coming in 2016 at WrestleMania 32, where he squashed Eric Rowan in a couple of seconds. He has made very few appearances in WWE since then, and he doesn't seem like he will return anytime soon. The Rock did tease a possible match against Roman Reigns earlier this year. Here's what The Rock had to say about that. We'll tell you right now. He says, I think if anything possible, sure of course, I'm always open. That's the cool thing about professional wrestling. There's an adaptability to wrestle you. Well, in the professional wrestling, you must never say never. To Vince McMahon, who has been one of my mentors for a long time in this business, we're very close friends and I'm very confident that you'll never say never for something like that to happen. We would have to have the right venue. The business model would be have to be right. I'm very close to Roman, and of course he's my family. We'd all have to see about that. Well, number four on my list of who I think should um is Booker T. Booker T has been inducted into the WWE Hall of Fame. First as an individual, and then as a, another member of Harlem Heat alongside his brother Stevie Ray. The 55-year-old legend has retired and stayed off, but his reality of wrestling promotion last February in 2020, and he still looks in good shape, and he seems ready to get back in the ring for one more match. He is potentially returning at this year's Royal Rumble, but that did not happen. He is 55 years old. He's the same age as The Undertaker. He also revealed on WWE Backstage at the start of the year that he and his brother Stevie Ray went to face a revival who are sadly not up. Who want, they wanted to face a revival, but they're sadly not 
part of WDB anymore. Current WDB commentator Corey Greaves is reportedly training to get to return in the ring, and Booker T says he would want it to be Greaves' his first opponent if the SmackDown commentator returns. In his Reality of Wrestling podcast, a two-time WWE Hall of Famer revealed that he wants to make a comeback and to finish off his WWE and illustrious career properly. Would you like to see Booker T make a WWE comeback? I sure would. I remember when he made a shocking comeback at the 2011 Royal Rumble and he also had a feud with the dashing Cody Rhodes. I really enjoyed that feud with Cody Rhodes. Hopefully Booker T can mix it up with the likes of maybe John Cena or Seth Rollins or all the other types of legends that are in there. Well, whoever it is, I'm sure it'll be awesome. So let's get on to the next person on our list. At number number, um, three on our list is Ronda Rousey. Ronda Rousey is number three on the list, so Ronda Rousey has not been seen on WWE television ever since WrestleMania 35, where she lost her Raw Women's title to Becky Lynch. The former UFC fighter took a leave of absence to have a baby, but there has been talk of her returning to the WWE ring as she still contracted with the company. Ronda Rousey spoke to Corey Graves on the After the Bell podcast earlier on this year where she said she would love um, if WDB allowed her to appear at a randomly at randomly at house shows. Probably whenever the hell I feel like it, she says. If they would just let me show up at live events, it would probably be very soon. She also revealed uh, one NXT superstar she would love to get in the ring with. And here's what she said. She said, OMG, Rhea Ripley is doing amazing. Like, I would love to get in the ring with her and have a match with her someday. She has matchups with everyone. She was differently. And there are so many things that I could really pull off. And we could do so amazing with Rhea Ripley. But with anyone else, I'm not really looking forward to seeing what happens, who I get in the ring with. But the opportunity is there. But I would love to get in the ring with her. She's fantastic. Ronda Rousey said, However, this was before the opera, the Ipress and with her WWE lifestyle and the WWE universe, which angered many fans in the business. Would you like to see WWE star Ronda Rousey make a comeback? And number two on our list is the icon known as Sting. WWE Hall of Famer Sting had to bring his pro wrestling career to an end back in 2015, which is five years ago, after suffering a nasty injury in a match with Seth Rollins. But it seems Sting could be available to have one more match against the WWE legend and icon, The Undertaker. This match could, could be a match for the ages in the history books and one of the matches in WWE they'll go down forever. WDB in an interview of Sting in December of 2019, Sting said there's a possibility of a match against a phenom, and he could get in shape. If Taker was in the situation at a WrestleMania, I would listen to that phone call. I could get in condition and I could pull it off. After the Undertaker and Edge Styles match at WrestleMania 36, where the where they told a fantastic story, many fans believe that The Undertaker vs Sting cinematic match style could happen. WWE commentator and Hall of Famer Jerry the King Lawler also said that the two legends could pull it off. Here's what Sting said. Now this style would easily meet The Undertaker in a match like that that I've always wanted to have forever. Sting, you can imagine watching that having a cinematic match like the Boneyard match was done. It could be awesome. That was a perfect location for the Boonyard match inside a cemetery. Would you guys love to see Sting return? If if you'd love to see Sting return, well then hit us up in the comments below. And number one on our list is CM Punk. One year ago, not many fans thought that CM Punk would ever be associated with WWE in any form or any way. 
but following his appearance on WWE Backstage, where he is an analyst employed by Fox, there is have been rumors of Punk waiting to return to WWE. Although Vince McMahon has not kept seeing on um, seeing this happen, but if Punk does return to the ring once again, there'll be numerous dream feuds that we can see. The former WWE champion himself revealed the superstars that he would love to face, and here they are. We'll tell you. As far as people that I've worked with, um, I think that there was a like a dream state of money that I, that was right. I think the guy like Daniel Bryan, I would go. I would listen to your idea if you said John Cena. Probably listen to your idea if you say Ray Mysterio. I would listen to your idea if you say something like that. If Punk does make an in-ring return, it would be awesome. He'd get one of the loudest pops in WWE's recent memory and recent history. Would you like to see CM Punk return to WWE? I think CM Punk should return to WWE. He would get one of the loudest ovations ever. At the Royal Rumble or WrestleMania would probably be a good time. Guys, if you've made it to the end, thank you very much. Oh guys, subscribe for more. We want to hit 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year. In the top right hand corner there will be more videos linked up there. So you can go watch them like the WWE Network releases a brand new free version. And WWE Live Events could be coming back soon. Just to name a few of the great videos like the bands in Bollyon. The bands in getting ours. All sorts of great videos you do not want to miss. There will be more videos coming out each day of the week. Do not miss them. Stay tuned. Stay cool for more of the Maximaniac. We've all been waiting. So guys, also the like of this video is 10 likes. Check out my website, maxcarlstaycool.com. I've also, got, I've also got a Facebook page called Max Carl Stay Cool Scanning. Check it out. Stay cool.